Hey guys, today I'm going to be doing an unboxing of the Smith & Wesson MMP Bodyguard 380. This is what I've decided to go with for my concealed carry here in Texas. I was previously carrying a Glock 42 and it was just way too big for me to conceal and so I wanted to find something um, a lot smaller and so I picked the bodyguard up. So this is the box and as you can see I decided to go with the non-laser because if I ever actually had to use this thing in real life, um, I probably wouldn't have time to be fumbling with a laser. So, there's that. But opening up the box now, it comes in a nice padded case. You can see that it's got the logo embroidered. I'm going to put that to the side real quick so I can show you what's in the box. It comes with the standard spent shell. the cable lock and keys and the registration card. So opening up the case now. There's on one side it holds the bodyguard and on the other side it holds the extra magazine and it holds six shells. Here is the bodyguard. And comes with this orange chamber thingy. But as you can see, this is the disassembly lever the slide lock, and I really like that this actually has a safety on it. Um, so it's just an extra layer of safety whenever you are concealing it. This is very easy to rack. Um, I'd actually tried out a Ruger LCP, and it was much smaller, but it was impossible to rack. So this, I found, is very easy. It has mag release, it has a double action trigger and it actually goes way back and here is, you can see the hammer strike. If I can show you the down the barrel, but it's a really nice small size, very very easy to conceal. Um, you can't even tell that I'm wearing it, which is perfect for jogging, and it's it just feels like a very solid gun. I'm actually going to compare it with the Glock 42 just so you can kind of see the difference in size as far as concealment goes because that was my main concern. This is the Glock 42 and here's, you can kind of see how much bigger it is. And side by side, you can see that the barrel on the Glock 42 is significantly longer. And the bodyguard is also much shorter. So hopefully that gives you a better idea as far as, you know, sizing to conceal. But 
that is the bodyguard 380 and I will do an another video and tell you how I think of how it shoots so hope you enjoyed it